Ah, yes, first Monday back. I've forgotten not to come into town on a Monday morning. It gets chock-a-block. <laughs> anyway, <coughs> not chock-a-block on the quayside. Hmm. I think I'll go and get myself a coffee. Well, there you go, people. We're back. <laughs> As you can see, I'm up uh, at the castle. Being reunited with uh, the love of my life, Nikki. <laughs> uh, yeah, I've got a bit of a problem. The um, little headlamp fairing, uh, the uh, top part came loose because it was cable tied on. And of course, the sun out here is vicious and it just was going to fall off so I've had to take it off but it does look a bit street fighterish doesn't it I might uh, might make a modification to that I've got to get another radiator cover I was promised one of those in the UK it never turned up but never mind and she needs a good wash because yesterday it tipped it down and uh, I got wet but yeah anyway um, so yeah we're back videos will get more interesting from now on um, and for the beginning of March, look at the colours out there already. Uh, Mount Enyus, looking fantastic. Zakynthos, very clear today. In fact, I might sit here and chill out for a bit. It's been a stressful, stressful ride. Doesn't look like it's going to get much better <laughs> very quickly. Anyway. Let's get on with the video. Well, here we go, another day, another dime. Uh, I've just been in the uh, pharmacy, which is over there. Um, there are other ones on the island. <laughs> Plenty of them, it's just it's where I tend to park the bike on the street. Um, it's right in the middle of everything, really. Um, I've been up there to get my uh, contact lens fluid, which uh, is 10 euros. It does last me a while, but it's... Uh, uh, quite an expense when you think I pay uh, spec savers um, £18 a month um, for a contract for my monthly prescriptions. Um, I'll get three months worth of uh, stuff out of them for £18, um, but of course, I can't bring this on the plane. And I think Pat might bring some out in a suitcase for me, that'll save me a bit of money. So now I'm off for a, a coffee um, at my local coffee shop, which is around there. There we go. Mid-March. And uh, the pigeons are wondering where all the food's gone. <laughs> As you can see, the, uh, the work on the uh, quayside has, has pretty much been done. They've put some electric meters in and water for the visiting yachts all the way down there. Uh, generally this is this end is where all the fishing boats end up coming in so I don't suppose I'll put anything there. They've even done the uh, the bit there that they were trying to do last year. I've noticed there are some cables and things out here because they do tend to put yachts on here as well so they're obviously going to put electric and water there. Not quite sure what those are going to be. There is talk about them uh, doing something around the back here with the properties. Because uh, they've done uh, a nice job of that as well. It'd be nice to have some cafe bars along there, I suppose. But, uh, well, you know, it looks like they're going to put meters and water and stuff on here as well for visiting yachts, which would be good. Yeah, definitely. They've got all the stuff ready for them, which is why they've tidied this up. So, there you go, a little insight into uh, pre season activities on the island. <laughs> There's a cruise liner in, as you can see over there. Apparently, the shops are all alerted at this time of year when one comes in, so they open up specially for it. <laughs> Good for them, I say. I'm off for a coffee. So you've all seen me walk along there 
a lot of times before on the way to Karen's. Oh, there's a nice little custom Triumph there, look. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Let's have a look at that, shall we? You don't see many custom bikes there because it's very difficult law-wise to, to do anything, but that's nice, isn't it? I like that. Pretty cool. Nice. Right, it's Saturday after all. It looks like they're open. We'll go and have a look. Um, but yeah, just on the right there is where I like to go for a coffee. I'll report back when I've had that. So if you're guessing where I am, leave it in the comments. <laughs> and I'll tell you whether you were right or wrong. <laughs> Took a trip down to uh, Trapasaki. I went to see uh, Mackis, but he was out in his olive field. Um, so I'm going to go back later on. Uh, anyway, yeah, Trapasaki, we're at the bus stop there. Now, much as we all love to see you in the summer, <laughs> when you're not here, look at that. It is one of the things I love about uh, the winters here. There's a few things I don't like about the winter here, <laughs> but one of the things I love is look at that beach now. I'm not a soul about. I've got it all to myself. I've been on a desert island. For those of you who know Kevalanya, you'll be going, "Oh, look at that, Tabasaki," <laughs> which is one of the reasons I do these videos for you. So let's have a little walk around. Um, Yes, I've been around for coffee and uh, cheese pie. <laughs> Highly recommend that place. Uh, they're really nice in there. And the, uh, the coffee's only like two euros thirty cents, which is uh, cheap, and it's a nice coffee. Had a nice ride. It's a little bit warmer today. The sun's out. Uh, walk across the little. Uh, now, as you can see, in the summer, that's empty, but we've had quite a bit of rain, and that's the, uh, the gully that drains off. So, so selling Sovereign Bay, I thought, uh, because of the luxury tax, we'll see how that goes. I might, uh, I might replace Sovereign Bay with a big, another big boat out here. But I don't know, but there is... Uh, one of those, you see that boat there, slightly bigger than that. And you don't pay a luxury tax on things about that size, I don't think. With a 30 horse motor on the back, that's a flying machine. But yeah, one of the uh, reasons I like the out of season times here, the beaches are very quiet. But that's not to say we're not looking forward to having you all back. <laughs> um, because I quite like seeing my friends Tavernas bustling with uh, with people. And uh, I like to see the town's busy as well. My friends making money. That's what the place is about after all. Some fish swimming around down there. So there you go, Trapazaki, out of season. There's supposed to be a beach bar somewhere, but they may have taken that down. They got washed away last year, and they built a new one, but uh, I can't see one at the moment. Maybe they'll put it up in the summer. So, let's crack on, back to Nikki, And uh, I might just sit in the sun for a little bit, actually. It's been a bit chilly in that flat. Well, there you go, Trapazaki out of season. And 
as you can see, it's a little bit overcast today, but it's a bit warmer. Thank goodness. Um, because it's been quite chilly inside here. Uh, the building doesn't really get much sun this time of year. Uh, we've got the, the mountain out the back, well, I'll show you. <laughs> the sun rises over the back here. You can see some chickens there. Um, sun rises over there, and of course, we don't get it till lunchtime-ish, really. Um, so the other problem I've had, I don't know whether you can see that up there, but that's a uh, solar panel for the solar water heating. So I've had no hot water until well, it's been lukewarm for about four o'clock in the afternoon. Uh, the building's been cold all day because it gets sun for an hour or two on its roof and then it goes and sets over there. <laughs> and uh, well, yeah, it's been a bit chilly, so I'm looking forward to getting in my own place where I've got my own, my own rules and I can put my own air conditioning on if I want. Because <laughs> that's what we use for heating if we've got nothing else. So anyway, uh, next week... I don't know what I'm going to do next week. I might go for a ride, I might not. <laughs> but I'll be taking you with me. For those of you who visited the uh, coffee page this week and PayPal, thanks ever so much. It really is helping. Um, well, I brought the shopping with it this week. Because <laughs> that's how tight things are. Um, but I'm hoping eventually I'll be able to uh, invest in a, a new editing suite. I've got a new laptop, but um, unfortunately the, the editing suite that I use uh, was free. It keeps wanting me to update, but I never do, and it does what I need it to do. Uh, unfortunately, when I got the new laptop, uh, I have to now pay for the editing suite because it won't download a free version that works with the phones and cameras that I use. So, um, I've already started, I've brought a little GoPro, which you can see there, which we're going to be trying out on the bike, um, putting into hedges so I can ride past it. I've also got a little sports camera that uh, Jenny gave me, of a &J Thomas. Shout out to Jenny and Andy. Um, so yeah, we'll be investing in the, in the site, hopefully get you some better videos. Don't worry, there'll be no posh music and no talking. <laughs> it will be me doing what I do. <laughs> but again, thank you for those of you who visit the coffee page. It means a lot to me, that does. And I hope to see a lot of you out here in the summer uh, and have some fun with you a lot. Um, because that's what makes the island after all the people. I know I've gone on today about, uh, about the beaches being quiet. I do enjoy that, but I also like to see people. So, see you all soon, and I'll catch you next week on the next one. Thanks for watching. What are you doing, Andy? Andy <laughs> He's not supposed to say that. <laughs>